And we're back with some more Super Mario Odyssey, this time episode 4, however part 2 in the Sand Kingdom playthrough. And let's see just how many more power moons we can find, and see if we can just overall progress through the rest of this entire kingdom. I just have no idea how long it's going to take. Uh, I'm just having fun and a blast doing it. Let's go. So let's go ahead and check out the shop to see if we can just buy that one power moon and then go to play the slot machine for the other power moon. And also, hopefully we can buy some of the clothing here to enter that one door that was locked. So let's check this out. Hey, hey, hey. What is up? Crazy cap. Okay, let's see. So there is the... Oh, wow. It's 100 gold coins. Life up heart. Nah. I think we already got it. So let's go ahead and... Um, yeah, we're not going to spend a thousand, a thousand coins on that box of shorts. Maybe at some point, but not now. Let's just do this one. And we got the power moon. And... Great. So let's see what else we can buy. Maybe we can buy the um, uh, the clothing to fit in. Because that one guy at that one door with the lock on it, we had to buy or fit in with some clothing to sing. And I think, let's, let's check this out. I think it was the first two, the, the poncho and the sombrero. I, I don't believe it was the cowboy hat or the cowboy outfit. So let's go, since we have 23 of the pyramid currency, we can just go ahead and uh, purchase both of these. We might as well, because I don't know what else we're going to spend it on anyway, since we can only use, I believe the character said that we can only use the currency here in this town. So let's see if we can't do it. Let's see, yeah, we'll just buy both of them. And, yep, let's change now. Can't wait to put on the poncho, huh? Yeah. Okay, let's go. See what he looks like. I'm sure he'll look pretty fly. He'll, he'll look pretty good. Let's see what Mario looks like. Oh, yeah, yeah. He needs a sombrero, though. Let's go to the uh, little changing station here. There we go. Oh, he looks great. Yep, let's see what he looks like. Ah, there he is. That looks awesome. Look at me, look at me. Hi, doggy. Okay. Now, we can't whip him into shape. Okay, let's get out of here. And see if we can't go to the slot machine guy. Now, before we skip both of these, because we had so few gold coins, I didn't want to waste them. But now it seems like... You know, we got 770 left, so I think we're okay to spend a little bit of money on the gambling. Let's see if we can find some more coins. Nope, that poster didn't have anything. Yeah, let's just go inside. See if we can't play some slots. Alright, let's see what this guy has to say. Oh, I'm trying to break some of these. I thought there was a coin in there. Alright, let's see what he says. Play some slots. The Test Arena game that's winning worldwide fame. It's 10 gold coins to play. Power Moon can be won. Try it. It's fun. Yay, slots away. Okay, we're going to do it. Let's see how this even works. I think we have to go over here and then toss, toss our hat across right at the right time. Let's see. Moon. Let's see. Heart. Moon. Heart. Moon. Heart. Moon moon. So as soon as that heart disappears, it's a moon, and I gotta hit the button. Let's see. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I jumped. Oh my gosh. I have to hit the Y button. Alright, here we go. Time it. Not yet. Here we go. Go! Oh, no! I hit the wrong one. It was too late. I hit it. It was way too late. Well, at least... At least we got, uh, at least we got some coins. Let's try it again. We'll try this again. 
see. Let's see. Yeah, we're gonna try this again. Slots away. It's only 10 gold coins per try, but still. It's kind of annoying, but... Let's see if we can time this again better. So right after the red heart. There we go. Got it. No, I didn't get it again. It's too late. Oh my gosh. It's gonna go on forever. Okay. Let me see here. Let's try one more. We'll just try one more. If we can't do it, we'll come back to it later. Okay. Let's do this again. It's only 10, 10 gold coins per try. It's not too bad. Alright, let's give it our best shot here. And again, in that same order, right after the red heart comes the, the power moons. Let's time it. Here we go. There we go. Oh, we got it. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. We got it. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, at least I found the third try. It's not too bad. All right. Sand Kingdom slot. Okay. So there we go. And I guess we'll just get the heck right out of here. What a play. Ten more coins? No. Why? We're already out of power moons. We don't need to play anymore. Maybe we'd get a heart or something if we get hurt, but other than that, nope. I think we're finished. Alright, so now let's go to the sombrero dude that says that we needed to be in this clothing. Oh, wait, let's see what our plants are doing. Oh, look, there's another one. You think that's another? I wonder if that's going to be another um, power moon. It is. Oh my gosh. Okay get it. Another power moon. So that last plant, that last seed that we can find, and I don't know where to find it, but I bet that could be another power moon. We still got a plenty of them to fill though. Let's see. We still have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine power moons to fill in the upper left hand corner. And I don't know if there are more than just nine more to go? Is that the max in this entire Sand Kingdom world? Or is or does it matter? Or is, are there more? I just don't know. I just don't don't know how it works. Anyway, so here we are. We're at this guy. Let's read again what he says. Dress like us, party like us. That's what we say anyway. So, snappy hat, check. Snazzy poncho, double check. You are... What do you say? You are ready to party? I think he said that. I clicked a little too fast. Alright, let's see what we're going on in here. You dance, and you dance, and you dance. Everybody dance! Oh! This is automatic, I'm not doing anything. You just stand in the circle. And he starts playing some jazzy tunes. Ah! Wow, that's cool. You get yourself a power moon for dressing up and dancing with the rest of them. That's great. Dancing with new friends. You got a moon. Yep, so we almost have the top row completed. Alright, well that was fun. Let's go ahead and see if we can get back over to the ruins because I want to check out the um, that little binocular thing and see where we need to go still. Okay, so we finally made it over here and yeah, because we want to check out Let's see, back up here a little bit. Toss it. There we go. Get in there. Now let's see where we have to go still because we... Okay, there's one up at the top of the highest tower. Obviously, we need to get that one. I don't know what's up there, if there's anything. Um, yeah, there's one over there. There's one on the pillar down there. With a heart. There's one over there, too. There's like four of them that we can probably pretty much get right now yeah there's about four of them in plain sight anyway all right so let's go ahead and get on up there let's see if we can ride bullet bill oh watch out watch out through the loops here get some coins Alright, so here we go. Everything's respawned again. We've been here before already. The first time around. 
We'll just let some of these uh, bullets get some of these blocks. Let's see if we can just uh, guide them over here. Oh no, there's enemies. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Get that last guy there. And we'll guide him this bullet over here. There we go. I don't think there's any bother with this one because there's no moon in there, so... Let's just get the other moon. Oh, here we go. Get Bullet Bill. We'll ride him across the way and get this moon. This one's been in our sights for a while. There we go. We got a moon leaning on the pillar. See if we can make it back without dropping on the ground. Here we go. Boom. Alright. We're back. Okay, so get on that trampoline thing. Flower. There we go. Alright, here. Let's ground pound this thing quick. Oh, we like coins. There's another spinny coin over here. There we go. More coins, the merrier. And let's see if we can make our way across whatever this is. I hope. Looks like we can stand on those. Looks like it's just a, a sand fountain. And yeah, there's nothing over there. I wonder what's in that whirlpool though. We'll check that out later sometime. Alright, jump! Jump! Oh no! Oh, okay. If you jump inside the sand fountain, I guess it pushes you back up, so. Oh. Alright, shoot this thing. Oh, we got a whole bunch of coins back there. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Now, this is cool. I like these kind of puzzles on the wall here, like the old school platformy two dimensional stuff. And it's kind of in tune with, like, old school pyramid drawings, you know? It kind of gives it a neat little touch. Let's see what happens here. Okay, so... Alright, let's get this question mark block. Ding, ding, ding. Okay, there we go. Get down here. Oh, no. Jump over this guy. Yeah, we gotta time it a little better. Okay, we got it. We got it. Jump up. See if we can get over. Oh, there we have some pyramid currency. Nice. Oh, okay. We gotta break a hole in the ceiling here. Oh, there's a hole. Okay. Nothing else? No. Get over him. Okay, let's break a hole in the ceiling again and get out. Oh, now we're back in normal, normal view again. We got some boxes here. Hopefully, camera angle's a little tight. Hopefully, uh, Bullet Bill won't get us from here. Nah, I don't think he can. Oh, uh, what's in this box? Glimmering again, shimmering, shiny. Oh, I didn't realize that was a thing. Another camera. What is that? A switch or something? What is down there? Yeah, that's a switch. We gotta hit that at some point. There's a moon over there. There's a moon on that pillar. Two of them, at least. We got two moons so far. I don't know what that is. And like, looks like purple poison water. I don't know. Oh, and here's the moon up top, the highest tower. That's the main one we're going to be getting soon. Uh, okay, so three of them. Four of them here. Oh, here's one. Yep. There it is. We broke the box. Wait a minute. Oh, it flew way over there. Okay, it's not making it easy, is it? Okay, let's see if we can get a top bullet bill here and ride him over to where that moon flew to. Alright, let's see if we can time it right. Get it! Ah, oh, I wasn't far enough out there. Alright, let's try this again. Wait for him to shoot out of his cannon. Here we go. Get up there. Yep, ride him. Okay, here we go. Just a short little trip. Kind of have to ride in the circle, though. Because we're flying too high and I don't want to drop off. Oh, okay, there we go. We just flew right into that little ice crystal thing. Oh, the, they keep shooting out. Okay, we got the moon from a crate in the ruins. Okay, we gotta watch out here. Okay, jump, jump, jump. Ground pound this thing. 
Yeah, there's nothing there. And let's get that switch. Get up there. Okay, here we go. Let's just drop down. And yeah, there's a switch. Little button thing. Let's pull that. Oh, it opens the door. So that way we have a little shortcut, I guess. Alright. So this is... I guess we'll just go back up here. Jump, jump, jump. Okay, just, we'll just get back up. Let's see if there's anything around the corner. No, there's nothing there. Alright, let's just get back up there. And... Continue on trying to get some more of those moons. Okay, here we are. Let's, we're back up here again. We probably have to do this multiple times. Shoot across the way and get that moon way over there. Hopefully the rocket will last long enough to get there. Yep, it does. On top of the stone archway is the moon. Okay. Wow, there's a long drop down, isn't there? Hopefully we don't fall down too hard. We take some fall damage. Okay. Jump on that thing. Oh yeah, that helped break our fall, so we're okay. We're good. Now we passed this so many times now coming up here. Let's see if we can grab this moon over there. That's an awful long way. I don't know if we're going to make that. That's a pretty far... No. Oh no, we barely don't make it. That sucks. What is this thing though? This little sitting area. That's kind of weird. Okay. Well, how do we get up there then? If we can't make it with the rocket. Why is there an empty picture frame here, Cappy says. Yeah, why is that? What do we have to put in there? A picture, a picture of somebody. Well, anyway, let's just run back. We'll run this way. That's the biggest tourist attraction in the Tessarium, the, the inverted pyramid. We keep a famous artifact there. We call it the Binding Band. Huh. Alright. Let's just move on then, I guess. Somehow we'll be able to open that up. What is this? Oh, there's something in the ground. What is that? And there's a sheep there. Oh. Oh, it's, uh, the, the game said do a ground pound. Okay. Well, we were going to do that anyway. Boom. Oh. There's a moon just randomly here. You got a moon lost in the luggage. Okay. That's cool. Well, let's do some more exploration. What is this dude here? I've got a customer waiting, but this looks... From the looks of this mess, I'm not going anywhere far. Oh, he's the taxi driver that the uh, guy's waiting for in the town when we started. You remember? He said, I'm waiting for the taxi. So that was that guy. Wow, look at that multi-moon in there. Oh, we can't get to it, of course. It's in the ice. So maybe down the line, somehow we can make all these the ice blocks melt somehow. Again, I remember saying before, there's no way we're going to complete all of this in uh, one playthrough. Oh, what is this? Greetings, traveler, and to your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does a thieving Bowser monster desire from this land? Sand, freezy treats, maracas, or ring? Well, I'm just going to say the ring. Because he wants the band of binding, right? You are correct! Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Well, that's random. Okay. Well, let's proceed. Let's see what's going on in here. Maybe a new puzzle or something. Holy smoke, there's a whole golden room. It's like a treasure room. That is neat. Wow, I'm going for the chest first. What's in here? Oh, of course, it's a power moon. Great. That's pretty sweet. In the Sphinx's treasure vault. Wow, look how much coin are these look at how many coins. There's like two, three hundred coins just laying about. Wow, that's nice. We're at twelve hundred twelve thirty four coins. Wow. That was a great little haul there. It always uh, pays to explore. 
That is for sure. Thank you, Mr. Sphinx, for the power moon and for the monies. Let's move on. See what we can find over here. There's a guy jumping about. Maybe he wants our attention. We'll see what's going on with him. Hello. Let's talk to him. No, 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 my beautiful sheep. The three of them have escaped, and now I'll never get them back. Oh, boy. I saw some sheep around here earlier. Yeah, there's one. There's one right here. So this is what? We have to guide them back. I think into the circle, maybe. Oh, wait. Where do you think you're going? You stupid cactus. Let's go back and get him. This might take a little bit. Let's go far around him. Maybe give him a shot of the hat. Boom! Whoa, we, we just spanked him. Spank that sheep. Get over there. Oh, no, not on there again. Okay, we gotta get him over there. Okay. There you go. There's a sound, a little tune that we got one sheep in there. Alright, there's taxi driver again, just sitting there. Alright, let's get this sheep. There's nothing in there. Okay. Ah, oh, dang it, the sheep got hit too when I did the ground pound. Alright, punt them back over there. Get over there. Spank that guy. Here we go. One more. One or two more. No, don't go on that cactus again. Here we go. We got it. Oh, he's going around the circle. Oh, there. He went inside. Alright, where's the other one? Now, the third one... I don't know where the third one is. Maybe he's over here somewhere. Hmm. Oh, there he is. We got him. We got him. Man, this, this area is so big. This whole entire sand kingdom is so, so huge that there's just going to be multiple episodes just for this one Sand Kingdom. Alright, let's see what happens when he gets in there. Oh, the guy gives us automatically a Power Moon. That's great. You got a moon, herding sheep in the dunes. Yes, there we go. Thank you, thank you, he says. Alright, let's move on. Now... I know we couldn't get that one power moon on that pillar, so, because that mirror, we have to put a picture in the mirror, but let's see what this is all about. A secret passage goes up there. It's underground, they say. Hmm. I don't know how to even get there. Those uh, pyramid currencies, it looks like we'd have to do the long jump to get to them, but I hardly find it going to be worth it to get those like four or five pyramid currencies. So we're just going to leave them alone. Let's see what this guy says. Don't touch that stuff. Maybe you can ride something across it. Well, we did try to ride rockets, but they're way too far away. I don't know. I don't think the rockets would make it that far. Alright, let's run back. This is the umpteenth time that we've ran past here. So, oh! I just now noticed. What's that door over there? There's an opening right here. What is this? Oh, there's a power moon in here. We've literally run alcove in the runes. We got a moon. We've literally run past this like ten times now. And uh, wow, that it pays to explore. It really, really does. All right, we're back up here for the umpteenth time. Let's get on this rocket. We're gonna go this direction and see if we can't head up that tower because that's where we need to go is that final that final moon or at least it, according to the game it keeps saying that we have to get atop the tower for this final moon and in the corner up in the upper left hand corner it shows there's one more empty moon spot now, I don't know if beyond this you can get more moons but they just get added to your list there? I don't know, but let's try out this puzzle here. Looks a little complicated. Oh no, I got hit. Oh dang it, I only have two hearts left. This is gonna be dangerous. We gotta make sure we don't get hit anymore because 
All right, let's get over there. Duck. Oh, we don't have to duck. Okay, never mind. Well, ducking's always good. All right, let's see. Can we get... How do we... What do we do here? Let's see. Get up here, I guess. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh! That was an accident. But I still got another four of the pyramid currencies. I didn't think to go in there. But that was a pure accident. That I ended up going down there. Okay, let's jump and get the coins. Nope, there's no more coins in there. Alright, we're gonna move over this direction. It, I think it's really cool that this puzzle is like this. Along the... Around and round and round and round the tower. That is kind of cool. Boy, this is gonna be tricky. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, so there's a there's a moving platform on the left there. We have to time it just right. Okay, we did not time that just right. You gotta go back there again and try it. Alright, let's do this again. We'll wait until that until it comes back again. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh no! No, no, no! Oh, we did it wrong again. Okay, let's go back here once again. Try it. And we only have two hearts. Okay, now we can go with the platform. Jump! Jump! Okay, I think we got it. We're done! Oh yeah! And now we got that, um, checkpoint. That's sweet. And that's it. This is the last power moon, I think, or what? What? Is, are we done with this area, or... Okay, we got a moon atop the highest tower. That was the main power moon, right? But no, it keeps going. Man, this place is huge! Okay, we're gonna have to do this for next time. We'll do the moon shards in the sand. Anyway, we'll, uh, we'll end the episode here. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, and we'll catch you next time in another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Adios, everybody.